What's up guys, this is BenMSC, and today we are finally finishing Dying Light. Um, in the last episode, I got all the way up to this, uh, crane elevator type thing. Um, but without further ado, let's jump right into it. Now we gotta find Rise. Now I'm gonna try to get through this as fast as I can. Oh, I'm not passing this up. Oh, crap. Um, but looks like we gotta jump up here. Go this way. Oh, there's Kareem. Crane. Rice said you would come. You've been shot. What the fuck is going on? This is what we get for trying to make a living. Rice betrayed us all. Yeah, I'm on my way up there, Kareem. I'm gonna kill that motherfucker with my bare hands. Not this way. We've laid mines on the two floors above us. Go through the second block, as high as you can, and you can come back. That's too bad. Cream seemed like a decent guy. Um, but what he said is we gotta go through here. <laughs> Boom, right off the edge, dude. Jeez, he fell so far he couldn't even see him. Mm. Karim managed to warn you, did he not? I was right to shoot him. Some might think it unsporting of me taking aim at you like this. I liked you better when you didn't talk so damn much. But I consider it a matter of, let us call it, leveling the playing field. That is a term you can understand, yes? Rise is so freaking annoying. Oh, there's a bomber there. Perfect, I still have some ammo. Oh, it's too far away. Now, there might be one or two more bombers, I think. And sorry for the lack of commentary. I'm, I'm very focused, so I'm going to try to keep you guys entertained. Oh! I'm going to stick with a shotgun, actually. I have six bullets. I don't think I'll actually need it, though. There's only one part of this where there's, like... Zombies that run at you and do explode. So I'm kind of hesitant about that. And it might actually be this. No, not quite. What the heck? Why can't I get through here? Oh, perfect. Oh, I almost missed that one of those, uh, the goons. That thing. Was just about to whack me with his hammer. Do some light parkour. Yeah, there it is. Ah! No! Okay, I better use this med pack, otherwise I'm gonna end up dying. You know, if there was an actual zombie apocalypse and the zombies were this stupid, humanity would have a 100% chance of survival. Except for the few idiots who would just, like, run into a bunch of zombies. Because they're literally just killing themselves. Um, but anyways, we gotta climb up this crane. It's kinda cool, actually, because right at this level, you can see a demolisher, like, up close, and it can't, like, destroy you. Yeah, he's right over there. He'll throw stuff at you, but he can't actually hurt you as far as I... As far as I know. He might be able to, like, kind of glitch through the wall and hit you. Um, but he himself can't actually get through. Yeah, Rides is all the way at the top of this thing. I probably should switch between my shotgun. Because I believe you actually run slower with, like, a gun than a, like, a machete or nothing. Oh, prime candidate. Boom! <laughs> he went past the building. He is going to fall all the way to the bottom. <laughs> just imagine if one of Rise's dudes is walking along and then a zombie just falls and hits him. <laughs> okay, this is probably the most challenging part of all of this. At least for, well, it was for me. You got to jump up here and I then just run. If you stop or, like, hesitate, 
you probably are gonna die. Oh yeah. <laughs> when I when I played this uh, game originally, I played on my laptop, and it was so hard because it was so laggy. I'm kind of curious what Rise is actually talking about. Consider yourself a member of an exclusive club. Where are you hiding, you fucker? Sad for you, it is a club I mean to disband. Hopefully I don't fall off on one of these simple jumps. Oh, this is the hardest jump in pretty much the entire game, actually. It's unusually long. Wow, perfect. First try. You just kind of have to jump just as you're falling off of the ledge. Otherwise, you're going to miss. Wow, perfect. First try on this, too. Oh, here we are at the top of the tower. Rides is just up there, and before we do that, I want to take a minute to kind of look at the city, at the map. I don't want to get too close, because then it'll start the cutscene. So this is the slums. I want to locate where Old Town is. Um, now, that... I can't quite tell if that antenna is at the top of that tower, or that mountain, or on behind it. Because if it is, then that's probably the antenna from that other little map that we had to do in the quest. Now, I want to find where Old Town is. I know that there, it's across, like, a canal or channel. Yeah, there it is. It's right over here. And I'm looking closer. I really can't see anything that looks similar besides the stadium. That tower might be the those little twin things, the one that's not finished. Um, but anyways, let's actually do this. So, face to face again. I guess that means I don't need this anymore. With or without it, Suleiman, you're dead. Come now, Crane. Do not pretend you don't care. How many lives depend on this disc? Hundreds? Thousands? Perhaps billions? <clears throat> You are right about one thing, Crane. Suleiman, he's dead. He died with his brother in this city. You don't even belong here, Crane. You don't know what suffering is. There we go, Rides is finally, well, almost dead. Yes, go on. You cannot resist. Do it, I won't fight you. Just as you killed her here. Do it! Fuck you, asshole. You want me to make my own rules? Rule number one. You're gonna spend the rest of your goddamn life in fucking agony. Do not leave me like this, Kren. Prove you are a man. God. Take your vengeance. Will you just shut the fuck up? Have turned in the blink of an eye. If I were trapped in Haran, this wound would have killed me. But now you dangle on the edge of life and death. While the GRE wait to take me to a hospital. 
I give you the honor of deciding your own fate. Hand me the disc, so that there is at least a chance that Haran might live. And I will make your death painless. Or resist, and doom this city along with you. You have until the count of five. One, two... All right, all right! Here! What's that for a decision, asshole? What do you want? Rise already told us he had that dead scientist data. All we're interested in is the cure. We're offering you a chance here. Get the rest of the research and come with us. And I can think of a lot of reasons to tell you to go fuck yourself, but why don't we just pretend for a minute that you don't think I'm stupid? You need the cure. It's here, in the city, somewhere. And as long as it is, you won't try to pull any ministry-style bullshit. No, not anymore, it's not. I'll be in touch when I've decided what to do next. Crane? Hello, Crane, can you hear me? It's Camden. Yeah, Doc, I hear you. What's going on? The analysis just finished on the tissue samples. The results are... Well, I don't think the word phenomenal is too strong. Crane, if you can recover Zara's data, I'm certain a cure is within reach. All right. Hey, we'll talk about it next time I see you. This is Io speaking. Get to the nearest safe house and wait until dawn. Good night and good luck. Okay, guys, we finally completed the campaign. Now, that was that cutscene was pretty cool. Now, I got to admit, the first time I played it, those uh, actions that you had to do took me by surprise, and I died a couple times before I realized what was actually happening. But it's generally simple. Um, I believe the Dying Light series is over. Uh, with this video, I'm not sure if I will put any more out. Uh, I might do some just random gameplay because sometimes you can have fun doing side quests. There won't be an actual series for that. Um, but with that, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to check out my other content, and I'll see you next time.